Portuguese island. We've decided to come and throw the pick here and have a brown the beach. Robinette comes up quickly in the front. Yeah, it'll come up really, really, really shallow here. Yeah. Straight up. How's that depth? 0.3. Do you want to rather go and see me further down down that way? One needs to be on one's toes, you know? Yeah, I believe so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So this is the way we anchor. <laughs> yeah, throw the anchor out. Throw the anchor, throw the anchor out. <laughs> and then bring the chain. <laughs> it's like a double story here. So we're on Portuguese island, that's Inyaka. We were anchored out there with the rest of the, the yachts and we threw, threw the pick yeah, there, there somewhere. Just for this afternoon and then tonight as well. I think we'll spend the night here. And yeah, it's very peaceful, it's gorgeous. Oh man, what a treat. What do you do here? No, no, it's not gat. Gat is a hole. But gaan hier aan. Okay. Jij moet koffen. He always buggers my videos. I don't know why. Because I don't we say it right. Brrr. And then it's like... We're making braai. That should be enough for just burgers, eh? Just burgers, my love. Just burgers. Job. 70, 70 liters of water every day. Nick, yes. I've taken over your job out here. Ah, good. Okay. I'm making sure he does it upside down. Oh, good. Yeah. Just the way you taught us. Look at that, oh. man. Not even a drop spilled. We were here for the Nyaka yacht race, and uh, sailing's always to do with the weather in it, and it, it just hasn't worked out the way it's supposed to be so and unfortunately I've got like family and business commitments so I do have to jump ship and head to the mainland and get a flight back to Durban. Okay. They've moved the start, it was supposed to be today, Friday, um, they've moved the start to Sunday about 10 a.m. Unfortunately Kurt wasn't able to extend some time, again family and you know work commitments uh, luckily Nick has managed to to get some time so he's staying on the boat with us which would be really great I'm glad that he's going to be sailing back with us with a strong south southerly that's coming um, through tonight 38 40 knots um, for about two days the sea state is going to be a complete mess not only will you be beating into winds about I don't actually I can't remember what they are for quite a few hours about six seven hours in the beginning of the race the sea is going to be very holy and messy and there's going to be yeah um, thunderstorms and it's going to be pissing down with rain see Not nice at all. Last night was worse. 
What was last night? That's a lightning. Horrible. Yeah, that's a lightning. Cold out here. Check out how warm it is below. And cozy. Look at that. <laughs> They're watching surfing. They're watching surfing. They're watching surfing. Yeah. So and eating curried scrambled eggs. Yeah. Yep. Dad, your shirt's inside out, you know. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Why are you putting those towels there? Because that chain yeah. rubs on the anchor locker, which is amplified in my cabin. It keeps me awake. So we tied it up, ain't got a towel. That's a lot. <laughs> you guys promised me beach, sun and such as guys. Yeah. And you delivered me rain, hey, you, hey, wet and work. Yeah. Wet and work. <laughs> and if you want to go ashore to go get water because we're running out of water. Get rid of the trash because we're not running out of trash. <laughs> We've got to take the tender down off the mountain. That's going to take another 20 minutes. And when we get back, we've got to hoist it back up again. It's lovely. <laughs> so it looks like there is no race this year. Seven entered. Only five sailed up here. Two pulled out. Then there were three. I can do my maths. Check that out. Then we find out today that CFM, Nigel and CFM have decided to leave today, Sunday, um, but they're going to motor back and Amber One is leaving at five o'clock tomorrow morning. So you have boats leaving at different times, which means it ain't a race. So unfortunately, the Naka Richards Bay race is not happening this year. Hello. What you doing? Love me is coming down, burning in the water. Yeah, okay, you guys gonna lower and I'll make sure she goes over. Yeah. That used to be my job. I'll take it. Pass it to me. kind of weather. Rainy, bumpy, windy, with it, oopsie. With no sun we haven't been getting any charge in the solar panels um, so our battery's been running a bit low. We've been running the motor to try and charge it but now we haven't got an issue with that. It's not charging the house batteries. What was the issue with the battery not charging? Do you really remember? Since I'm an electrical engineer, I can 
explain these things to you with a clue. Now the battery charge is designed to prioritize the charging of the start the engine battery, the start battery. So it delivers charge to the start battery before it changes over to the house battery. Strangely enough, sometimes it takes longer than one would expect, so like maybe an hour of charging the start battery before it switches over and starts charging the house battery. So if you're looking at the house battery, you think, hey, not it's not charging, it's not charging, it's not charging! <laughs> and then Nicholas shed some light on the issue, and after much observation, and data collecting, we came to the conclusion that that's what was happening. We're going to have to try and attempt to go to the island again tomorrow. We need more. We need more water and get some more groceries um, to prepare for our trip back. But it looks like it's going to be pissing down again tomorrow. I'm just hoping that the wind doesn't doesn't get too strong, so we can get across. The weather's still looking good to sail back to South Africa. So we plan is to leave around 6 p.m. We're sailing back to Richards Bay from Inyaka. Well, motor sailing. Yeah, it's very different from our trip up to Inyaka. That was nasty. So we're expecting a northeast to come a little bit later. So hopefully that will give us a nice push back. Back to the bay. That's a good spot for a spinnaker, eh? Yeah. The water is so blue. We could get some good fish here, but we can't put the rods out, so we've got a hand line out, but it's not really working. Chance to dry out at least. <laughs> this has been quite wet. Oh, it's not strong enough for the, for the spinnaker. So, 
Nicholas and I are going to drop it. We're going to secure it on the aft section of the vessel. On the aft section? There. That's the bow. Yeah, there. That's the aft. We're going to tie it down and we're going to, <laughs> we're going to hoist the steel, the steel sail. Oh, okay. Why are you wearing that t-shirt? This t-shirt? Uh, yeah, that one. I don't know why I'm wearing this t-shirt. I worked hard for this t-shirt. And I deserve to wear it. Do you know why? And I'll tell you why. Because? Because you've picked your lungs out for four days? No, not that. Okay. I've endured 40 knot storms, pelting rain, wild seas. Wild, I tell ya. And that's only on the way up to New Yorker. Then, at anchor, followed by three days of corkscrewing about rain and heaven fever. And you do this for fun? Yeah. But, not only. And yes, I know the official race was cancelled. <coughs> Bless you. <coughs> Bless you. But, we're still sailing in your Richard's Bay. Okay? I declare this a race. It's a race, I'm on my own, I'm in a league of my own, but it's a race. It's a race to a hot bath at Bayonne. And the last reason why I'm wearing this is because. Bay Port Control, Riches Bay Port Control, this is a sailing vessel seascape, sailing vessel seascape. Good morning, thank you message Good morning Port Control, uh, we request permission to enter harbour, over. Thank you. Thank you Port Control, out. Yeah. Oh, that's quick and easy. Juanita, we like Juanita. And we're on the list, that's why. And we're on the list. <laughs> we did our arrival procedure correctly. We're on the Department of Transport list. So everything runs smoothly. So you better register with OSASA to come into South Africa. No hassles coming in. And chances are checking procedure with Port Health, Immigration and everything like that will run really smoothly. I've got confidence. guys heading out to go fishing for the day. It's about 6 a.m. and it looks like the shark's board in the background there. Checking the nets. Yeah, 
Anyway. Cheers, guys. Bye. Thank you. I'll see you at the club tonight. Cool. Okay. Thanks, Tash. Bye. Well, yeah, you're going to get juice for me and you.